It's gonna be your shit, I know. What's up, y'all? It's your girl Terry, and today I am back um, with a with a wig review this time. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so let's just get right to the video. Oh, all right, y'all. So yes, today I am here with a uh, a hair review. Um, I'm gonna be reviewing this hair that I have on. Actually, it's from Ali Pearl Hair. It's a wig, and yeah. So I'm just gonna basically review it and tell you guys what I think about it. Um, this video is gonna be super duper short. Well, shorter than my other videos. So, yeah, y'all listen. Oh, if y'all wondering why I look so cute, it's because I'm I'm about to go out. <laughs> I'm about to go out, but I want to record this video for y'all before I leave. So, this unit right here is Ali Pearl's Deep Wave unit. It's a 22 inch, and I believe the density is 180. Um, it is a lace front wig, and it's with the Swiss lace. So, I believe that's everything about the wig. Um, I, I'll link all the details down below, and I'll also put the direct link to this hair if you guys decide that you want to purchase it or not. Okay? Okay. All right. So, first, I'm going to start with the positive, because if I start the negatives, y'all just go click off the video, and I don't want y'all to click off the video. So, I'm going to start with... The positives so honestly like this hair is super duper full like it is really full and I love it because when it dries it gets like really big and I really like big hair but it's super full and it's pretty long to be a, um, a 22 inch so I'm just gonna try to turn it around so you guys can see but it's really really full and it's kind of long right okay so that's number one. Number two, um, I haven't experienced much shedding with this hair. The only shedding that I did experience is when I was cutting the earlobe part. Um, you know, when you cut cut around the ear so that little piece come off with it. So that's the only shredding that I've uh, had. After, even when I'm like going through it with my fingers to wet it and stuff, it it doesn't really shed too much. Like maybe one or two strings, but that's normal. I mean, your real hair shreds also. So the shredding is not that bad actually. Um, I really, really love this curl pattern. I don't think I mentioned that this is a deep wave wig. Ooh, yeah, that's important y'all. <laughs> <laughs> this is a deep wave wig so the curl pattern is super duper nice and super defined and yeah it's really really nice so when I wet this hair there's no problem with it going back to its like its original state it goes straight back it snaps really really back so that's also a really good thing also the um the hair in itself is super duper soft it's not hard it's not too soft to where it feels fake though it's just like it feels good it's, it's really good. Um, what else can I say? I didn't even bleach. The hair doesn't really need too much maintenance on the lace. I didn't bleach my knots or anything. I just put my makeup over it and threw the wig on. So that's also a really good thing about this hair. I don't think you have to spend too much time dyeing the, I mean, yeah, dyeing the lace and everything. Or even plucking. Like, I didn't pluck the front. I was just super lazy, y'all. I didn't pluck the front or anything. I just do this strong okay okay all right so um the parting space there was a quite a lot of parting space like i can't show y'all but y'all can see how far this part goes back right here that i have like it's, it's quite a it's quite a bit of parting space like i could do a half up half down if i wanted to or anything like that like i'm not limited with what i can do so the parting space for this to be a, on a only a lace front wig is pretty damn good like I, I like it. Um, all right, so now let's move on to the cons. Okay, all right, y'all. So there's not, there's two main things that's bad that I have to say about this wig. And they're not necessarily bad. Maybe it could have been my fault, but I don't think so. But I'm just gonna let y'all determine that y'all self and y'all can figure out if y'all wanna order this wig also. Okay, so number one. I also forgot to mention that this wig was a size medium. The cap size of it was a medium. 
Um, so when I any wig that I get, I usually get a size medium. But for some odd reason, this wig was just not cutting it for me. When I tell y'all I had to pull it, to like stretch it to the front, I literally had to stretch this wig to the front. Like, if y'all pay close attention, y'all can't really see it because the lace is kind of blended well. But... You see the hair is all the way back here, like, in the baby hair. It's like, I just, I don't know how to explain it to y'all, but, like, I had to pull it up so, so far, and I couldn't even cut the, you know how you usually cut right at the tip of the hair? There's still, a, like, not a lot of lace, but, like, maybe this much, this much of lace um, that I didn't cut off because I needed it to fit my head. So that, that was, like, a really big problem for me because the wig was... To me, kind of small to be a, a medium, but whatever. I got it to work and it looks bomb, so I'm not tripping too much. I just want to know how it's going to work when I want to reuse this wig. Like, what's that going to look like? And the only other bad thing I have to say about this wig is that for it to be a medium and the front to be so small, the back is like super duper loosey like it has the adjustable straps and everything and i hooked the adjustable straps on but it still has a little bit of moving space back there which kind of irritates me because i like my wig to be pretty damn snug in the back so if i wanted to throw it in a ponytail or something i could do that and i don't have to worry about the back lifting um i really like i'm gonna have to take my time and do that ponytail with this wig because the 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 back of the wig is super duper loose but yeah those are the only two bad things I have to say about this hair, honestly. At night, I literally just put on my scarf around the lace to protect the lace, throw it up in a ponytail, and um, wake up in the morning and let it down, and it still looks beautiful. So there's not too much bad about this hair. I would just recommend that you order the right cap size, whatever that means for you or your head. So the way that I maintain this hair, if you guys do want to know, is I literally just put water on it. That's it. I just started putting oil on it just to give it a little bit of a shine, but I kind of like the natural vibe too, so it just depends on which day I'm in, if I want to shine or if I want it to look like, you know, just super duper natural. But yeah, I just put water on it and, I, um, and I'll put a little bit of oil on it. So yeah, guys, so this is the Ali Pearl Deep Wave Unit 22 inch medium size um, lace front. But that is the end of this video please like comment subscribe to my channel and catch me in my next video bye guys even when you're not here you get all of my time sweeter than a number nine with a large sunrise every nigga in your past